All right, guys, let's go. We're working legs today, okay? The quadriceps, the hamstrings, and the calf muscle. Okay, we're going to be doing a squat. Okay, straight leg, bend over, toe touch, or with the weight, straight leg deadlift, and simple toe raises. Let's do it. If you don't have dumbbells, use water bottles. If you don't have water bottles, dumbbells, then use your own body weight. Okay? Grab a backpack, put some books in it. All right, we're going to start off first with just a standard foot position. It's 10. All right, let's keep it going. Three more. Okay, good job. I'm gonna switch up now to the hamstring. Back to my dumbbells. You guys do what's good for you. Toe raises. Let's hit it. Five more. All right. Great work. Great work. Okay. Hey. So in between your sets. You don't want to necessarily sit down and rest. You can do something different. Some jumping jacks, running in place, sit-ups, even some light stretching. Okay, today we're going to be working on the legs, the quadriceps, okay? And a little bit of work on the hamstring, the back of the leg, and the calf muscle, okay, the lower part of the leg. The legs, we're going to be doing squats. Basic squat is the most basic, uh, most popular leg exercise that you can do. Very beneficial to your health, working your legs. All right? One thing you want to understand is the further you go away from the heart, the more difficult it is for the heart to get blood to those areas. So by exercising, doing simple movements to make the muscles contract, contract, tighten up. The muscles squeeze on the veins and the capillaries, helping to pump, helping the heart to pump blood through the body so the heart doesn't have to work so hard. 
All right, let's get started. So without any weight, let me just show you a squat, okay? Have your feet shoulder width apart. This is a standard way to do it. You can do them close. You can do wide. Some people say sumo squat. But just starting off, shoulder width. Squat down. Use your arms to counter, counterbalance. And just squat. Just sit down. Just, this is something ideal that you want to do here. And from this position. This would be a full squat going all the way down. Now, be careful if your knees go out over your toes. Be careful. You shouldn't be doing this. That's bad posture anyway. Some people talk about the knees going over the toes and starting all these fads, whatever. Okay, just keep it simple. When you jump, you're in this position. When you run, you're in this position. When you walk up steps, you're in this position and stepping. Your knees are not doing this as you jump, run, or walk up steps. So don't waste your time with fads and unnecessary things. All right, if you have dumbbells, make sure they're tight. Okay, make sure the weight is comfortable for you. Now notice I'm not going all the way down. It's not necessary all the time. Maintain your posture. It's not natural to do this. Your body will bend naturally. But don't, don't do this. All right, that's a different exercise. We want to squat. All right, let's switch up. If the weight is hitting your leg, bring your feet in. If you want to do a little something different, step out. Let the weight stay in the middle. Okay. In between your sets, you can continue. Let's go up. Toe raises, calf raises. All right, great job. We also want to work the back of the leg. So we're simply going to be doing the old fashioned toe touch. Keep your back flat. Don't round. Stay flat. Go to the point that you are comfortable. If you feel tightness, then stop here and up. Use your hands. Don't rest, but go here. So one or two or all the way down. Make sure to keep your head up, your chin here. Don't do this. Don't throw your head up. You possibly might get a head rush and uh, might cause some dizziness or cause you to pass out. 
So picking up your weight. Now, what if you don't have dumbbells? Grab water bottle and e even two if necessary. Just hold them the best you can. Take your time. <clears throat> if you don't have water bottles, dumbbells, you can still perform the exercises. Just follow along here, <coughs> put some books in your backpack, or ladies, grab that bag you call a purse. That should be enough weight. All right, good. So, once again, <coughs> very beneficial. And of course, weight. If you don't have the weights, you're doing squats here. Okay, no weight. Go down, touch the floor. Okay. Or, again, a narrow stance. Use your arms to counterbalance. All right. Good job, good job. I'll be coming at you with more videos. Let's get yourself fit. Be strong. Be awake. Be body. All right, guys. Share this. Build this community. Be strong and peace of mind. See ya. <laughs>